Okay, what we have here is our AV3, our automatic vertical bandsaw, and uh, we're going to go through a quick description of the machine. Here we see the, the left fence, which is our indexing fence, um, and that receives its uh, direction from the uh, DLC. Uh, we have a blade sharpener, if you want to use a band knife blade, this is a precision blade sharpener. We also have an outboard fence on this machine, and as you can see here right now it's in the down position. Uh, which allows for loading, use of loading of the foam. Um, during normal operations, uh, this would have photo eyes set up with a perimeter around the machine. So if someone were to <coughs> walk into the cutting area, it would uh, turn the, the blade off. We're now going to tilt the fence up. And uh, we're just trying to expedite this uh, without spending all the time we normally would. But the fence goes up. We'd already loaded the foam into position. And so what we would do is we'd move this fence up to the foam. Actually, we'd be pushing the foam up against the other fence. Fences are in position, the foam is ready to be cut, and we go to our batch setup here. And we basically ask the machine to cut two inch pieces, and we'll say we want to make two of those pieces, and then we want to make two and a half inch pieces, we want to make two of those. Okay, now we are ready to go into, we turn the blade on, and we set our mode to auto mode to begin our cutting process. We cut, index, <coughs> machine cuts in both directions. We are currently using a scallop blade. These fences are 40 inches high, so you can put a pretty good tall bone in there. You can go up to 50 inches on this particular machine, as far as bun head goes. And all it's going to do is continue putting the batch that we put in there. So the operator can turn the machine on and walk away. So that cycle is done. Open it up. And we can uh, lay that fence down. And then we can come in. And here's our cut pieces. 